The Osmo Pocket is a very lightweight camera with a very well working 3 axis stabilizer. You can see a lot of people trying to make stabilizers for the 4th axis that the up and down movements can be neglected while walking around. Either, commercialized and do it yourself solutions look very similar. I decided to simplify the construction and go a completely new way. The idea is to use a three folded layout and use an elastic cord rope instead of metal springs. This gives a lot of advantages. The most important advantage is that the extended arm length decreases the frequency of oscillation. With this construction, I receive less than 30 cycles per minute, which supports a smooth stabilization. The overall construction is very simple. All items are easy to find in a normal hardware store for construction. There is no need for a parallel movement as the three axis stabilizer adjusts the horizon even in its follow mode. The elastic cord rope gives an additional damping effect whereas for a metal spring construction you need to install also an additional damping system. Quick adjustments of tension are made by means of a simple wire rope clamp. The camera, mobile phone, and its holder are located at the end of the arm which gives additional inertia and less influence of uncontrolled friction. The construction is with the mass of 1 kg very lightweight. The damping of the Osmo Pocket for left slash right rotations is good, but I got very often shaky results when I had to make left or right turns. I decided to install an additional rotational disc with a rigid metal pin connection as a grip. This did indeed was effective and now I obtain much smoother left and right turns. If you finished organizing all the items, it will only take about 2 hours to build up the stabilizer. You need to cut the aluminum U profile into pieces and drill several holes. It is very easy and quick to adjust the tension for the arms. The wire rope clamp should still allow you to displace the rope forward and backward when you push hard. Eyes bolts should be mounted that way, that the rope usually stays in place. The tension of the elastic rope should be found that upper and lower arm are nearly parallel to each other. The vertical arm should be nearly perpendicular to the other arms that swinging of the arm falls equal into place. Here are some examples of footage. Even listen to the footsteps in the first clip. I did not carry out any ninja walk and the result seems to be very smooth. Especially this narrow hollow way seems to be a good stress test. You need to look left and right whether straight lines become wavy.